Oh, hello. Welcome to another video. We're going to be eating a lot of stuff. Miles and I have an array of Japanese snacks here. I haven't tried any any of this before. Wow. Um, this is all going to be a new experience for me, except for her. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This one. This, clearly, I bought this for this video and we ate half the bag already, so... This I've had before, and it's probably like one of my favorite things in existence, so I felt like it was worth bringing. I'm gonna try it right now. I'm so hungry. It's still really hot, too. Mmm, <laughs> she's steamy. Also, I'm pretty sure we're gonna be eating this whole thing because it's 3 p.m. and this is breakfast. We're puppy sitting right now. So, is Coca Cola Plus like Coca Cola but with nutrients? I mean, I think so. I think it, it's Coca-Cola with dietary fiber. I mean, like, look at this image right here. Yeah. Like, it's giving <laughs> health and fitness or something. Yeah, it's a, it's giving, like, Olympian. Yeah. You want to try that? I'm um, sure. Mamma mia. <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> oh my gosh. Cheers. Cheers. I mean, it just tastes like Coke. Yeah. It's Diet Coke with fiber. It tastes good though. Like it tastes regular. Yeah, it tastes fine. I guess you need more fiber in your diet than have Coca-Cola Plus. Go ahead and try her out. So now you want to Word it! Word it! <laughs> oh my god! That's not yours! No! Go lay down! Oh my god. Now! Go lay down! I don't know what's real! <laughs> oh my god! A disaster. We're getting ate up here. Is this what it's like making a video when you have children? <laughs> Poor thing. Warden ate all of her food. Warden's a bully. I can't believe it. So these are beef tongue flavored umaibo. And if you don't know umaibo, she's basically like a giant Cheeto. So one long giant Cheeto. Yeah. Mm. Wow. I don't know what the tongue part is. It, all, it tastes like bulgogi to me. Yeah, it tastes Korean. Mm -hmm. It's very delicious. Wait, let's see if I can focus on the texture for you. So it's like a Cheeto with a, with a hole in it. All right, that's really good. It's like a sweet meat. These are really good. I'm gonna buy these again. The blue ones are really good too. If you never ever try that one. The blue one? The tonkatsu one. I don't think I have. I mean, we might as well oh, yeah. just eat one of these. Portage. This is just the best flavor probably of anything in the world, I feel like. Yeah, by far. This is the corn potage flavor umaibo and... <laughs> it really is just... I didn't know I liked corn soup like that <laughs> until I had these. Mm -hmm. I was like, okay. And also corn soup doesn't typically come with this texture. So mm -hmm. it's like a flavor matched with a texture that is unexpected. It's truly the best. They come in like so many flavors though. Like this is two of probably 20. I don't know. You wanna try the squid? Sure. Here she is. Seasoned dried squid. She's spicy? Pretty She's spicy. spicy. We'll see. We'll see if that's a true statement or someone was lying. Oh, why is it? You think we're that like weird? Bite it out or something? Mm hmm. Okay, that looks a little better now. Here we go. It definitely has the a squiddy scent. It tastes good though. Not bad. It reminds me of something, but I don't know what. Oh, it reminds me of the pork floss that me and Tima tried from uh, the Thailand snacks video. This is um, flossy pork. Mmm. Whoa. Wow. But the squid version. Wait, do you think it's spicy? Yes. I mean, it's there. Yes. For it's, me, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Perhaps then, now it's time for another drink. Oh. Let's see if we become straight. With a new straight tea. I love it, Bob. Every time I'm feeling like I'm having homosexual fantasies, I just pick up my straight tea. Uh, mm, mm. Yep, that's right. Love to have sex with my man. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. I am absolutely attracted to women. Oh, sorry, wait, not yet. I haven't drank it yet. Okay, <clears throat> so right now, I'm still gay. 
All right. Strength tea time. Hell yeah, bro! I love that Fuck. dude! <laughs> okay, it tastes just like regular tea, though. Hello? You wanna try this? Calorie meat? I don't... Sure. I've, I've never had that. That looks like... Actually, it looks very aesthetic. Like, I've definitely seen that in an anime somewhere. I don't know what it is about that packaging, but it's so familiar to me and I can't. We must have seen it in a million places because I also feel that with it, like attracted to it. Like attracted to it. <laughs> so it's a nutrient bar. I guess so, yeah. It's like, oh, oh, you need some calories. Okay, so maybe I have eaten these before. So this one is just the, the original flavor, and here's what she looks like up close. She's a biscuit. Oh, I hope it's like a shortbread cookie. That would be delicious. I mean, not. I wouldn't consider that a health food, but. Cheers. Hmm. Interesting. It's not. Why does it taste like wine? <laughs> it does. This tastes like white wine. Hold on. <laughs> it made my mouth really dry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I can't even like calorie mate block swallow it. <clears throat> contains a nutritionally balanced source of energy needed for daily activities. Calorie mate block is great for people who are always on the go, needing an easy way of consuming energy, nutrition, whether it's for breakfast, work, sports, study, or any busy time. Oh my God, it is a shortbread cookie. Mm -hmm. It's flour, flavored fat spread, Sugar, processed apple. Uh, white wine is not in the ingredients mm -hmm. though, so. Would I buy it again? No. But it's not like. I think this would be better like in a coffee, like swirling mm. your coffee with it. Did you try those? We have four desserts, not yet. You wanna try those now? Yeah. These look spicy. Yeah, I think, I mean, I'm hoping they're gonna be sour. We'll see. These, it looks like ume, like salted plum. But wait, does chili. it say? Oh, just kidding. It says it in English on the back. Okay. Oh, and Oh, wow. Mm -hmm, I missed that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cute packaging though, I love it. Okay, she's fairly seasoned. Let's see. Mmm. Mmm. I really like them. This is really good though. It is. I'm mad that the bag is like, so small. It has five chips in it. Right. Oh, one more savory thing. Actually, before we do that, let's try it. CC lemon. CC lemon. It has the vitamin C of 28 lemons. Ooh, that's a lot of vitamin C, Frank. That is a lot of <laughs> vitamin C, Stacy. <laughs> and I can't wait to try it out. Wow, look at that pour. That's a great pour. Mm. Oh, lemony. Wait, why does it, it taste kind of carbonated? Am I? Yeah, it's carbonated. Interesting. I was not. Expecting that. Wait, hold on. Does it just taste like Sprite? Let me close my eyes. Okay, it tastes like 7-Up or Sprite. I would say 7-Up because 7-Up yeah. is more lemony. I'm getting it's very like much- a carbonated lemonade. The ingredients are carbonated water, high fructose starch syrup, sugar, and then lemon juice. So I guess they just injected it with vitamin C. It's not actually. Well, that- <laughs> That seems dishonest. I'm gonna take another bite of this. And then we have our next contender, popcorn bits. What are these? Oh, they're like little tiny sunbay with a rainbow. Sunbay for the gays. Yep, that's right. Love to have sex with my man. So they come in little individual bags. Love the packaging. And that's what they look like then. They have crystallized. There we go. Beautiful. Ooh. Ooh. Wow, already, yes. Wow, 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 wow. Mm. Yeah, I will be eating this entire bag. It's like a little salty, a little sweet. Mm -hmm. Super country. Country. <laughs> Super country. Super country. I'm living. Remember when we did the oh, ASMR when churches? Oh, churches? Mm -hmm. On Tima's channel, taking turns going up to the mic and crunching. Mm. It was so good. It really was though. And then they closed all the churches around us, so RIP, we'll never have it again. <laughs> okay. Well. I 
feel like this will be a good transitional one. What is this flavor? That is a good caramel corn monburan. I don't know what monburan is. I don't know why it looks like flan. Hey Google, what is monburan? <laughs> Hello? Hey Google, what is monburan? Death Factor in Mongaran Funeral Home is on 132 Portage Street in Doyle's Town, 2051 miles away. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you say that, Google? Girl. Look at this. Little crunchy maggots. Yummy. Mmm. The crunch is way lighter on that mm. than, than these ones. It's a soft puff. Yeah, but they're still good as well. I don't discriminate when it comes to crunches. I love all, all types of crunch. Let me Google, Mont Blanc. Oh, a Mont Blanc. Mont Blanc from Japan. A dessert of sweetened chestnut puree in the form of vermicelli topped with whipped cream. It was created in 19th century Piedmont in Italy. So that's what this is. Huh? Okay, yeah, that makes sense. That looks noodly. I was I gonna say it looks like flan with like spaghetti on top. I'm like an egg. What is this called again? Mont oh, Blanc. I guess that's just like the, what's the word, Japanization of Mont Blanc, Mont Buron. Mm. That, that feels like that makes sense. Now, first of all, I usually call this Pocky. I feel yes. like I can't call it Pocky. by its real name. Yeah. Did you, like, do you remember finding that out and being like, no, that's wrong? That's, that's absolutely incorrect. I don't like um, that at all. Pokey. <laughs> But apparently that is how you pronounce it. Oh, Ooh, bye. Yes. Goodbye. <laughs> goodbye, everyone. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. I feel like I've had every flavor besides this one. So I thought, you know, like we had to try some Pocky for Japanese snacks tasting. But like I wanted to pick one that I haven't had before. So. Ooh, chocolate. I wonder if it's gonna taste like a mound. Hmm. Ooh, it's like, Wait, is it toasted coconut? Okay, this is way better than I thought it would be. Normally, I don't like coconut, but Same. this is acceptable. Mm -hmm. Not that I don't like coconut, but usually I'm like, I would rather not. Unless it's toasted coconut. Right, like I could have it like a dinner kind of coconut. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or coconut milk and stuff. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Which one should we try next? All right, let's do it. Cold up flavored fettuccine. <laughs> Something tells me it's gonna like snap, crackle, and pop. Just take a gander inside that bag. This is not what I was thinking. Yeah, and also it's like I way it shorter. Was be a chip. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be like um, long, like noodle noodlier, mm. but ooh, mm. oh, but my ooh turned into a hmm. What does it taste like to you? I mean, cola. I can taste the cola. I definitely taste the cola. But then after a minute, it kind of tastes like dish soap. I could see that, but I don't necessarily mind that. Yeah, that kind of, I was gonna say, but not soap is kind of banging a little bit, you know? You know when you get like, I don't know, a rose flavored, like you just got mm -hmm. a rose flavored, what was it? A rose flavored lemonade? Lemonade, the other day. And I love rose stuff. And um, I don't know, any floral kind of things like jasmine, but like sometimes it tastes a little bit like, like a grandma's perfume, but still delicious. Mm -hmm. This edible grandma's perfume. It's time for our final <coughs> beverage. Okay, I really like the bottle on this. I love the it's whole aesthetic. Cute. Cherry blossom yeah. cola, like are you serious? Yeah. This is very cute. Oh, we can play. Oh, the thing. Yeah. Does that have a name? Korean drinking game. <laughs> Period. <laughs> <laughs> It's so pretty. It's like the perfect pastel pink. It really, color. wow, and like. hello. Oh, mm. wait, is that what it tastes like? Sakura? Yeah. Sakura? It tastes really good, but also, I don't know if I know what cherry blossoms taste like. It's definitely giving floral. Like there's this, mm. this aftertaste that's like. But like not as, Perfumey, I guess. Mm. I don't know. It tastes pink. It literally has cherry blossom extract in it. Like what? Wow. Grape color extract and citric acid flavor. 
there's also some flavor in there. Oh, good. <laughs> They're not specify- specifying <laughs> which flavor, but it is a flavor. Yeah, just know that a flavor exists in that beverage. Maybe that's what I'm tasting. We're on the final. Are we really on the bover? The boss. We're on the keep, keep girl boss. The balls. Did you get some on you? I feel like I did. Oh, it's just like soil. And lactating chocolate milk. So the final thing is this brown sugar boba milk tea dessert. And I guess there's boba inside. I'm very excited. I hope there is, cause like... What if it's just boba flavored? Oh my God, Oof. that'd be so disappointing. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> oh, wait, I feel it. Oh, you got some in there? I think so. I, I felt <laughs> some, some squirming. Mm. Oh, it's a mini boba. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's a mini boba. <laughs> Run that back. Oh, it's a mini boba. <laughs> oh, it's a mini boba. <laughs> boba boba. I'm going in for a second <laughs> round. <laughs> yeah, they are very mini, but yum. Like, does it have a name? Is it just called mini boba? Yeah, I guess it's just mini mm. boba. I don't know. Boblets. Yeah, boblets. Bobitas. I don't know. It wasn't giving. It's not giving boba to me though. It's giving little pellets. And then it kind of just tastes like whipped cream. Well, I'm I'm very I'm very confusing right now. But I actually like that texture. I used to y'all gonna look at me crazy, but I used to microwave my ice cream. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> when I was a kid, I would always get it kind of frothy on the outside, but still kind of like melty, like soft serve, mm -hmm. just enough. And this is kind of giving soft serve a little bit, but it's a little bit more balmy. I'm um, also, just so we can both be canceled in the same episode, I used to let my soda sit out when I was a kid so it can go flat. Before you drank it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, somehow we really ripped through all of that. Yeah, so, I, mean, I was very hungry. But that was lovely. Okay, do you have- delicious. Do I have a favorite? Do you have, yeah. Or favorite savory, favory, favorite sweet, favory. <laughs> <laughs> favorite sweet, favory. A favory sweet? Yes. Honestly, <laughs> favory sweets. <laughs> Period. I think I'm gonna have to go with the chips. The chips really surprised me. The chips are really good. Also, it's hard to decide on a savory because this is really good, but it also feels m meal. Lee? Yes, and it, not it is very mealy. Like, this is lunch. Yeah, this was like we happened to have a mukbang, like, inserted into our snack trying video. And since it's curry, it's a little heavier. Yeah. So, I'll definitely fill you up for the time being. And this is just like one of my faves of all time. But since we've had it already, I don't think it's fair to her. So for this video's sake, besides those, <laughs> I think I'm gonna say the chips too. When it comes to beverages, Ooh. I think my fave is the Sakura Cola. I'm gonna say my favorite was the CC Lemon. I do okay. love my um, citrus carbonated um, yeah. sodas. So, mm -hmm. uh, but aesthetically like her, She's 10 out of 10 all the way. And then a sweet thing. Actually the, mm, wow, this is hard. Cause I was gonna say this, mm -hmm. but the coconut Pocky kind of surprised me too. And then also this caramel corn is really good. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go with the caramel corn for me. I'm gonna say the Pocky. Cause she, she, she surprised me. She caught me off guard. But that's it. Uh, if there's any Japanese snacks that you've tried that you are mad that we didn't try today, Please let us know in the comments. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to see my channel, don't. We'll you can back. follow Miles on Instagram, <laughs> right here. Yes, here's my Instagram. Oh, and thank Things you, CC Lemon. We love CC. Oh, I should have called you CC instead of Stacy. Shushi, shushi. Oh, if you want to watch our grandmothers, you can click that at the end of this video. And uh, thank you to everyone on Patreon. If you want to check it out, patreon.com slash soundlyawake. I said that really fast, but you know where the link is. And I'll see you soon with a new video. Okay. Bye. Bye.